John Scott Harrison was the son of a United States president and the father to a United States president, making him the only man with this distinction. His father, William Henry Harrison, served as the ninth president in 1841. His son, Benjamin Harrison, would then serve as 23rd president from 1889 to 1893. John Scott Harrison was one of ten children. Early in life, he proved to be highly intelligent and would go on to study law and medicine. Despite this, his true passion was farming. He would end up managing land inherited from his father rather than pursue a career in law or medicine. Like his father, he would also have a large family of 13 children. Benjamin Harrison was the fifth eldest child and third eldest son. From 1853 to 1857, John Scott Harrison did serve in the House of Representatives for Ohio's 2nd District. But after an unsuccessful re-election bid, he retired from politics and returned to his plantation at age 53. Twenty-seven years later, he died at age 73. Approaching Harrison's burial, his family feared that his corpse would fall victim to body snatchers. Body snatching is the illegal taking of dead bodies from morgues or their resting places. It contrasts from grave robbing, which involved stealing valuables from a grave and selling them. In body snatching, the target was the corpse. Usually the purpose was so that the bodies could be dissected and studied by medical students. So common at the time, body snatching even spawned a black market. In fact, on the day of John Scott's burial, the Harrisons learned that a body recently buried in the same cemetery, that of Augustus Devon, had been snatched. In response, John Scott's coffin was fortified and a watchman was hired to check in on the grave every hour of the night for the following weeks. The day after the burial, some of Harrison's sons investigated the Ohio Medical College, where it was suspected Augustus Devon's body had been taken. Hidden in the building, they found a fresh corpse, but it wasn't that of Devon. The corpse was that of their father, John Scott Harrison. Just the previous night, only hours after he'd been buried, his coffin had been carefully infiltrated and the body extracted. Later, when the coffin was examined, it was clear the body snatchers knew ahead of time how it was fortified and how to get around it. How they acquired this information is unknown. The watchman claimed to have no idea how it happened. Ohio Medical College officials claimed the snatching had been done against their knowledge. Nevertheless, the outraged Harrison family filed a suit against the college. Three years later, the Ohio Anatomy Law of 1881 passed, which allowed unclaimed bodies to be examined by students, thus destroying the body-snatching black market. John Scott Harrison's body was returned to a proper resting place, though the exact location is unknown, and it's possible the family intentionally kept it a mystery.